Hello guys, this is Johnny McFudge and I'm going to bring you a tutorial for how to install your Easy Cap. This guy asked me, he said, Hey dude, I recently bought an Easy Cap and the drivers I tried from the files folder that I downloaded came up with Windows was unable to install drivers for your USB 2.0 video capture controller. Any help? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here. If you don't know how to get to the device manager, manager you go to start and then you you go to start right click my computer and go to manage then click uh, on the device manager and you should see your easy cap right here do right click update driver software and do br browse my computer for drivers Okay, this is this is what I do. In order to ensure it, I go inside the EasyCap driver, and there's one more folder in there. So go ahead and click the drivers folder. So it should read files installer EasyCap driver drivers. And I just do the include subfolders because it always helps with other installations. So I'm gonna go ahead and click next. It should be like installing driver software. And if it says this, go ahead and click the bottom one. Because if you click the top one, I'll show you what happens. If you click the top one, it says this. It's not good. Um, we'll do it the right way now. And if you click the bottom one, install this driver software anyway. It'll come up, and it'll be like, taking like 10 minutes maybe 5 minutes install and then you'll have your easy cap installed I gotta watch the time so just wait for it um it's done it says windows has successfully updated dr your uh, driver software and so kick click close and if you ever need to uninstall it for some reason or you don't want it on your computer anymore it's right here and you can just uninstall under imaging devices alright so hope you guys uh, this helps you and if you have any other questions or if this doesn't work for you then please send me the make and model or the model of your easy cap if the box usually tells you what type of easy cap it is if it doesn't then I will try and look for a driver that will suit you guys because I know there's a Syntec STK1160 I think so hope this uh, helps you out a lot and please don't forget to rate comment and subscribe just ask any questions if you need them alright later